Hello guys, welcome to a new video and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to play Nintendo 64 games on your computer. Um, before this video starts, I recommend that you own uh, the N64 games that you're going to emulate in real life. Otherwise, that's going to be piracy. Some other people may say that, you know, if even if you do own it, it's piracy. Honestly, this video is made for entertainment purposes only, but um, let's get into the video. So, what we're going to be using to play our N64 games on the computer is a software known as Project 64, as you can see right here. Project 64 is a very popular Nintendo 64 emulator, and that's what we're going to be using, so let's get right into it. So I'll leave a link to the site in the description, or you can type it here, pj64emu.com. We're just going to go to download here, and your download will start automatically. Now go to the second link, and it will bring you to this site. Now it looks kind of suspicious and whatever, but it's actually completely fine. It's basically um, a huge vault of Nintendo 64 ROMs and other ROMs to be honest. You just want to go to the sidebar here and click the vault. And then you want to click Nintendo 64. You just want to choose what N64 game you want to emulate. So um, I'm going to get Mario 64 and download it. Honestly, you guys have to trust me here. This site is completely safe. I, I would not offer you guys a site that gives you viruses. That's just not me. Now what you want to do is you're going to open up your Project 64 setup. Now we're going to launch it up here. So English. And here it is, Project 64. With the file you download for the game you want to emulate, you're just going to extract it to whatever you want. It doesn't matter where you extract it. I've extracted it to my desktop here. It should end in .z64 or something 64. Um, if it's .exe, then that won't work, and that's probably a virus. But from the site I sent you guys, .z64 and .n64, those are the ones that should work. Um, so yeah, here's the ROM file here. Now what we're going to do is we're going to open Project 64, click File, Open ROM. Now you're going to simply open the .z64 or .n64 file, it doesn't matter what extension. Just make sure this isn't a .exe, and it shouldn't be because the site bin button that I sent you guys is actually pretty safe. Alright, so we're going to open it up here, and everything should go swimmingly here. So, Hello. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, um, leave a like and subscribe. Oh wait, another thing you can do, another thing you probably want to do, go to options here and click control Config, configure controller plugin and this is where you can change your controls you can connect a controller if you want and um, you know just configure all your controls but that's going to be it for today's video if you guys found this helpful make sure to like and subscribe to the channel we do videos like this some semi often I guess I'm going to try and start making more of these videos but I will see you guys in the next video goodbye